necklace is rubbing against the mic. So I am necklace. <laughs> You don't want me to prosper! Hi, my name is Juliana. I'm in my second year and I'm studying chemical engineering at the University of Manchester. Finding this internship was actually a case of your net work is your net worth. I actually have a friend who had done the internship previously and the way this internship worked was a very in-house kind of thing. It wasn't advertised on Grad Cracker or Total Jobs and she actually knew that I wanted an experience to do in my summer. So she forwarded me the information, she told me to contact, and that's how I kind of started the process. During the internship, I got the chance to do a lot of networking around the different departments in Shell because as a chemical engineer, there are so many roles you can actually uptake in a company like Shell. I also got the chance to actually work in-house in the modifications department and do specific work centered around um, oil production of an oil rig and just got the chance to meet some great people and just enjoy myself. What I enjoyed the most has to be actually applying my engineering knowledge that I had so far to a real life situation. I think it's very easy in chemical engineering to work with box diagrams for unit operations, but seeing these real unit operations come to life, seeing how all the technologies that they have actually contribute to operation, it was really fantastic. What I learned was that if you want to make an impact in these industries and something specifically that you don't like about the world or about a specific industry, I would say jump straight in, you know, go work for that kind of industry, for that kind of company and make a difference from, from within. My three top tips for securing an internship at Shell. Number one is the dress code. Make sure you're dressed really professionally and really smart and you just really take your appearance seriously. Best impressions do count. My second top tip, preparation. Going on things like Glassdoor, looking at the way Shell actually kind of marks these video interviews or face-to-face -face interviews. They have specific guidelines that they actually mark. My last tip I would say is confidence. When you walk into the room and just in everything you do, whether you're just listening to somebody, like you don't need to be the loudest person in the room, but you need to carry yourself really confidently and just have faith, like have a little bit of faith and have confidence that the job is potentially yours. My name is Juliana and I am part of the Student Inspire Network. <laughs> Hi, thanks for watching. We hope you like it. Remember to like and share the video on Facebook and go here for the Student Inspire Network YouTube channel. Go there for the video that we made last week and comment down below because we'd love to know what you think.